blood clot? This part legit looks like amber. It looks like there should be a frozen scorpion in it. You are familiar with the try not to eat format, but today we're going to do a try to keep eating challenge while watching. Ooh, we're doing this again, let's go. You must finish the dish while watching the video of how it's made. If you do not finish, you will lose a point. If you make it all the way through without losing a point, we'll give you a prize. However, this time there is also a punishment. I knew it! I didn't think that I was walking into this scared. I yeah. am now. I've never done one of these, but I'm actually very scared. You I think, should I be. think you're scaring me. Peasy. Easy. Easy yeah. peasy lemon squeezy. What is this? Oh my god, is that natto? Yo, this is round one. Have you ever heard of natto? Are they beans? They are beans. Are they fermented beans? They are. It's not I so good. <laughs> so first you're gonna take your chopsticks and stir stir up the Oh, really get this going. Get yeah. the, I mean, this is... I've had natto and I love natto. It's this is it, this isn't even a challenge. This is like free food right now. Oh! oh my. That just hit! Uh, then we're gonna have you add the two sauce packets, which we think are soy sauce and Chinese mustard. You think? We think? <laughs> you think? You don't know? Like, I don't really know how you can, like, describe the smell of natto. It's like... It smells like Play-Doh. It smells like an old person, but... <laughs> it smells like dirty sauce! Why do you hate it? I mean, it looks gross. Literally just slimy. It looks like chunky peanut butter that's gone off. Here's your educational video on how natto is made. What is natto and how to make it? It's very slimy, like it's the beans move slimy. around in your mouth. I don't wanna. That is terrible. That looks like spider webs. The, the, the uh, soy sauce and the mustard really help. Ooh, Japan, mm. yep, the Japanese mustard got a little bit of spice to it. Mm -hmm. I can't eat this. Bit of a slimy texture. The little cake from the mustard. I can't eat it. All right, you're gonna have to win this for both of us here. No, you gotta do this, man, come on. I can't. But it really doesn't taste that bad. People keep saying like it tastes awful. But it's not horrible. I don't think it's as bad as people make it seem. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Like the beans are okay, it's just the goopy stuff. I think I'm done. Oh, I got two beans left. I can't eat it with chopsticks, I'm sorry. <laughs> Every time I, I just wipe love it, it all away, over, it's I just, more I just love it all over my lips. I mean, it's like I walked into a spider web. That's what it feels <laughs> like. It increases the nutrient content. Okay, so it's also nutritious. I can't get the rest. Easy. You got. You gotta throw something harder, harder at me than that. All right. <laughs> Point taken. <laughs> I know what that is. So up next is a Filipino favorite, Isa or grilled intestines and Betamax, which is grilled blood curd. I see, it looks like a macaroni noodle. Just keep thinking that. It's just a Fun. brick of blood. Oh my gosh. Blood so this curd? is a blood clot? Oh, come on, man. What, what, tie it, be positive. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, when you get this on the street in uh, Philippines, it would come with a variety of vinegars and sauces. Ah. Uh but not today. I was gonna Rude! Say. Now I can see where this is going and I, I'm loving this because I, I love eating this kind of stuff. You ready to put your headphones on and watch? No. <laughs> Game time! Oh, it tastes like egg. Mmm. Mm. It's, it's actually not that bad. People find it disgusting because you tell them what it is. Mm -hmm. Look at it, look at it. Look at that. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. It's like a water balloon. Well, these intestines are a little mushy, but... <laughs> that way. It's like egg yolk texture, and I'm not a fan. Interestingly enough, it almost has like, like the texture of well-made liver. You have to keep eating whilst watching the video. I don't think I can, honestly. If I get this with like some grilled onions, we're good to go. You get in your head and think like, oh man, it's blood, yeah. it's gross, but it's really not that bad. <laughs> Oh my god. I definitely do wish that I had the sauces with it. Man, I'm telling you, agents know where it's at. Like, this stuff is so good. I'm powering through it. I like the taste of it. It's just the the consistency of chewing it multiple times. It has the same texture of an egg. Oh, it's stuck <laughs> in my it upsets feet. my tum tum. The intestines wasn't too bad, though. Just think of it like little brownie bites, right? Little Debbie's blood bites. I mean, that was hard. All right, you guys sailed through. Well, unfortunately, Brian, you did not finish the dish either. I know. Nicole. <laughs> I know what this is. I do, too. Do you know what this is? No. Oh, you're in, you're in for a treat. So we have a 100-year-old egg or a century egg. I have no idea what it is. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I've seen them on the internet. <laughs> I love eating this stuff. Okay, good. I already don't like eggs. <laughs> I have like the palate of a child. It might sound nasty, and you might not like it, but I at least give it a try. 
There you go. I was honestly sm expecting it to smell way worse. Oh, oh! <laughs> this is the food, like, when you look at it, and you're like, oh, the food's gone bad. We should probably throw it out. There's really cool pattering on this. Yeah, like, egg. look at it. Like, look at You can almost kind of see through it. She's pretty. Like, it's a really pretty egg. This part legit looks like amber. It looks like there should be a frozen scorpion in it. I've never had it just, like, straight up like this, but All right, I Ed. think you're going to enjoy it. <laughs> okay. So it tastes like egg jello. Like, I just love the way, like, look at the, the way the light hits it. Should you eat it before we know what it is? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the jello part isn't terrible. It's not horrible. It almost tastes just like a horrible egg. The smell's kind of wild. It's an the egg. The smell. Don't smell it. Okay, everyone overhypes it. Everybody overhypes it. I love gothic food. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm not gonna shovel this. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna ruin yeah. the rest of my day. It tastes like an egg, though. Like, I lied when I said it's not that bad. But honestly, it doesn't taste that bad. Would yeah, I yeah. eat it again? No. I think I got some eggshell. Oh, I missed a part of shell. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. You gotta stop. I'm so sorry. It tastes like a hard-boiled egg from 7-Eleven. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. I don't really know how to describe the flavor to you because it's a little unique in itself. It tastes like egg. <laughs> Whew, that was rough. Uh, all right, well, neither of you guys finished this dish either. No. All right, you guys both made it through. See? So finally, we have a lovely slice of head cheese or a jellied sausage loaf. Sure is. Have you ever had head cheese before? Head cheese? Give me a rinse! <laughs> a saltine! You gave us a fork and a prayer. <laughs> you ready to see how this is made? Uh, I... I don't even know what this is. Oh, there's the hog's head. See, I'm already sad and grossed out. They're cutting up, okay, they're cutting up the head of it. Uh-huh. Uh, the hair! I'm eating brain, aren't I? Oh, now it's just like a hairless cat, but it's a hairless pig. I have no appetite at all now. This is good. <laughs> <laughs> this one's a little, that one's a little much. It tastes too much like salty meat. I'm so sorry. I can't. I'm so <laughs> sorry. I've oh, used a bathtub. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Bit. It's the video part that that does it for me. Oh, this part's fine. Way more salty than I was expecting. Are you okay? Do I look okay at all? Yeah, I don't think I'm. Gonna, I don't think I'm gonna be able to continue to eat that one. I probably wouldn't recommend this to someone. Please don't throw up. I don't think I can take that. I'll do my best. I'm I'm fine with like gore in movies, but like whenever it's stuff like that, or my mm -hmm. mom or my mom's watching Grey's Anatomy, I can't. <laughs> I got it. What you weren't thinking? watching a pig's head be cut open while you were eating it. I was also listening to someone about to throw up. That'd be me. <laughs> Congratulations, we've got a rather delicious, bizarre food for you to try next. Okay. Ooh. Yay, we're right. done! <gasps> so this is a pork floss bun that's very popular at Chinese bakeries. And after one bite, you'll know why. It's, I don't know how to describe it to you. It's, it's, a, it's a strange texture, but a combination. I mean, I love this one. Mm. That's bussin'. <laughs> so it really is just meat? Yeah. So there's meat in this? They just keep going. The twine is the meat. That's why, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It tasted, I expected it to be sweet, but then it tasted like meat. Obviously it doesn't taste like this, but it feels like um, saw, sawdust. sawdust. Thank you. It, it does kind of look like Right? That. Wow. It's like That's PTSD crazy. Blending. So they just keep cooking it and cooking it and cooking it. All right, Presley. This is good. Oh, For those of you who didn't make it through, we've got both a food and video you will have an interesting time eating. We should we should do the punishment anyways, even though we're winners, then we'll be the real winners. What do you think? Sure. What do you think? I guess we will also give you the punishment food. Yes. Oh no. Oh! Ooh, what? So we've got some lovely lamb brains prepared in traditional Moroccan style. To go along with it, we have an ASMR video of brain eating. No! God! These are really small. I mean, it's bigger than my brain, but. <laughs> Can turn around, please? <laughs> I'm gonna please. save the rest. For, yes. Crank that volume up. Let's go. We eat some yes. brains here. I'm getting like little parts of the brain. See, that doesn't look that bad. I mean. No. <laughs> I hate this ASMR. It's not terrible. I, okay, so we got some brain here, guys. And maybe it'll make me a little bit smarter. Oh my God, that's spicy! I'm just gonna sit over here and eat my little bun. I can taste its thoughts. <laughs> mm -hmm. This isn't even that bad. Like, okay, it's just, 
You just do it. There's like. I hate it. I'm trying to not listen. I hate this. It's definitely, it's definitely this part that's worse than this part. <laughs> I got the chili. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Hearing myself in my own head is okay. Hearing her in my own head is what's not okay. <laughs> Bad. I just hate ASMR. Boom. Brain is good. Try the brain. The brain is you. good. It's just soft. Honestly, brains not bad. But I'm telling you, try it first before you knock it. Like a lot of the stuff, surprisingly, you might like. Yeah, it tasted um, great. Great's a strong word. It tasted good <laughs> for brains. I'm just glad I didn't puke. Me too. Oh, thanks so much for watching. What did you think of this new challenge? Let us know down in the comments below. Let us know what else we should try. Brains. Mm. <laughs> and let us know what else other people should try, but not me. As always, remember to like and subscribe to People vs. Food for more delicious content. Bye. <laughs>